So in a previous video I showed you about uh, cheating to create melodies using Melodyne and Studio One but not forgetting uh, Ableton. Ableton has some interesting tools in order to do something similar. So uh, I found this sample, this organ bass, which I'll bring in. It's quite a complicated sample but it does demonstrate how good Ableton actually is at doing it. So have a listen. <laughs> absolute ton of reverb on there it's quite complicated so right click convert melody to mi new MIDI track it looks through it now I don't know how good this is going to work out to be well, let's have a look not bad that's quite impressive so I'll load a, a plugin um, well silent as it's popped up um, place the MIDI on there let's see how it goes let me just find a suitable preset from let's have a listen I'll just bring it down entirely usable let's add a beat to it let's see what that does um, add some loops I know top loops and then I'll add a kick okay uh, cancel that add that to the wrong column <laughs> Okay, let's have uh, a look at user library. I made some kicks. Um, I just had a straight C. Oops, let's add them there. Let's see what this sounds like. <laughs> So we've got to do some tidying on this MIDI. Um, let's quantize it. See if that changes it. So with a little bit of playing you can make something that is starting to be usable just with a little bit of tweaking here and there. So hope that helps. <laughs> Thank you. 